I am Charles Denham, chairman of TMIT and the host of the Global High Performer Webinar Series. We've produced more than 100 sequential monthly webinars delivering more than 200,000 hours of continuing education since 2009 through www.safetyleaders.org. Whether you watch the webinars live or on demand from our website at a more convenient time, the slides and references are available to you for download. We continually survey our global network of quality leaders regarding their critical patient and caregiver safety needs. This information drives our programming content. We invite you to watch and learn valuable insights from our webinar addressing the opioid crisis and drug diversion in healthcare organizations. Opioid adverse events and overdose issues in the public are a true crisis. They continually rank as two of the most important topics requested by our audience of professional and family caregivers, healthcare administrators, patient safety leaders, and healthcare stakeholders. The explosive incidence of opioid overdoses in the public causing more than 175 Americans to die every single day, is mirrored by the dramatic increase in drug diversion in healthcare organizations by healthcare workers. In the first introductory segment of this webinar, we address the latest news regarding the MedTech Bystander Care Training Program that addresses opioid overdoses as one of the seven leading causes of death in healthy children, youth, and adults in workforce years. The dramatic growth in opioid overdose deaths across the country now exceeds deaths from gunshot and traffic accident deaths combined. We address them in the webinar in addition to the history of repeated false beliefs that new formulations of the same opioid drugs are not addictive. We introduce a new innovation called the Care Pack, which can be used at schools, with teams, and with groups who take the bystander care training. It is a backpack that includes an AED, tourniquets, and the devices that can help save lives, including EpiPens and auto-injectors of Narcan for opioid overdoses. And we cover the recent development of the life-threatening risk to professional first responders and bystanders from synthetic opioids of fentanyl and carfentanil. Their potency by volume and rapid ability to arrest breathing with the smallest of exposure poses enormous problems in the field. Our lead speaker is Kimberly New. She's a registered nurse, attorney, and national drug diversion consultant who has been nationally recognized professionally and by the lay press. She shares her publications and terrific insights regarding the daunting and ever-expanding drug diversion problem in healthcare workers, which is growing as rapidly as the opioid abuse crisis in the general public. She addresses how unreported diversion is, how diverters cannot be identified by appearance, and how suspicious behaviors are a tip-off only late in the game. She covers why every institution needs a formal prevention program. She identifies tampering as the most frequent diversion method that greatly increases the life-threatening risk to patients, why diversion has a high risk for patient harm, and how education can reduce the risk to all concerned. Dr. Greg Boats, Professor of Anesthesia and Critical Care, and Bill Adcox, the Chief Security Officer of MD Anderson, were reactors. They affirmed the critical need for work in the area of drug diversion, and they provided enormously valuable affirmation of the principles Kimberly New proposed. Dan Ford, a national patient safety advocate and former healthcare industry executive, provided the voice of the patient and championed the cause of including patients in the dialogue regarding this important problem. This webinar on drug diversion will be the first of a number of webinars on this topic. Our audience survey revealed a great need for more information. Our learning objectives, as always, are organized by the four A's. Awareness of the evidence for improvement. Accountability of who should adopt new practices. Ability of what skills can enable improvement. And action. What line of sight actions will yield impact. You may receive up to one and a half hours of continuing education credit per webinar, depending on your professional requirements. We are so grateful for our broad global audience, terrific patient advocates, world-class subject matter experts, and our core team. All of them serve with no financial support of any kind from an industry source. The recorded webinars with slides and resources are available for download at safetyleaders.org. You can also watch them on our YouTube channel at youtube.com tmit1.